Florentine here, Austin Jones. What's your occupation? Watchmaker, sir. I had this dream. What? About the future. So you designed these yourself? What are you looking for? I need precision. Charles Kidder? This is going to be a little bit of slip. We can adjust the torque. How about money? We'll figure it out. We, we create a small model? Be honest, we're talking global. Where in Boston you want to do this? In Switzerland. We invest in businesses, Mr. Jones. Not in dreams. So do I. Don't forget to set your watch, Jones. Schaufhausen is six hours ahead. Well, I guess that makes us men of the future, Charles. What we have planned here on the banks of the Rhine is revolutionary. So welcome, everybody, to a new era of watchmaking. It's beautiful. It's all beautiful. That's an awful lot of watches. But still not enough, Charles. Just imagine Boston, London, New York. To the American, who will tell the Swiss people how to make watches? <laughs> He's going too far too fast. What do you mean? They're coming over. Who? The investors. You need to talk to him. He won't listen to me. International Watch Company request additional machines delivered immediately. Same specifications. F.A. Jones, full stop. Six more months is all we need. Is to money. This is your last chance, Mr. Jones. Cut your costs. Cut production and get your feet back on the ground. No. Come on, Jones, you've had it wrong this time. <sighs> Gentlemen, what we do here will change everything. In time. You're done here. Did I dream too big? <laughs>